Hi Ben, Sarah from the upcoming, lovely to meet you. So why do you think events like this are important for the future of British film? Um, well, it's important for the fundraising for BFI to be able to make, to be able to um, do all the different things that they do. You know, I certainly think the kind of restoration and the, the, the um, archiving of, movie, of British movies is really important because it's all very delicate and if you don't look after it, it'll be gone and it, we'll never be able to get it back. So that side of it, and it's something that people don't really think about because they just assume that everything's forever all the time, you know, and it, and it, and it isn't, it's all really delicate. So that, that side of it's brilliant. Um, and I think, you know, then the support for, for young up and coming British filmmakers is really important. What do you think might be the barriers to new and emerging artists getting involved in film? Um, I mean, I think it's open in a way that it's never been before in terms of like technology. So the equipment is all there, but it's more a distribution issue now of getting your stuff out there. And it's easy to get stuff out onto the web where everyone can see it. But it's how do you make a living out of it is the harder thing. You know, every, every other aspect of filmmaking seems to have a way of making money out of it, except for making the films. <laughs> So everyone around it is all right, but the, the filmmakers struggle, I think. So I think that's, you know, that, that's definitely a barrier. And we're on the eve of the British Film Festival, two weeks um, ahead. So what's going to stand out for you this year? I don't know. I'm just going to go and go and have a look, really. I mean, I'm, I'm, I want to see um, Blade of the Immortal. I'm quite excited about that, the Mikke film. And I'm going to go and see um, Ghost Story and, no, what's it called? Um, oh, oh, I can't remember now. And then uh, the... Uh, what else is it? I was going to see one other one. Uh, oh, yeah, let the, the corpses tan. Yeah, so I'm excited about that. And what do you think makes the London Film Festival unique on the, on the, in the wider landscape of festivals? Um, you know, selfishly, it's, it, I can get to it by car. <laughs> so it's really good in that respect. And, um, and you know, and, uh, it, it's, it has a focus on, on British film, you know, and, and that... And the, you know, every, every other of, of these of the big festivals always focus on their own kind of area, and it's great to have something that kind of looks at Brit looks to Britain for uh, see what everyone's up to. And what about your projects? What have you got in the pipeline? Yeah, we're just writing at the moment and trying to get financing together. So it's kind of that. That's we're looking hopefully to shoot in the new year at some point. So I can't. You know, I'm not going to. I've done about three years of saying what I'm going to do next and, and then jinxing it. So I'm just going to keep quiet now. <laughs> All right, fantastic. Well, enjoy the evening. Thank you.